That's how some spent the day on the St. Joe River for the first ever East Race Whitewater Festival. ABC 57 Samantha Johns was at the festival for us and joins us live from downtown South Bend with more. Sam? Brenda, it's officially summertime and those competitors that I spoke to earlier today tell me they were excited to get back out on the water, beat the heat and also have some friendly competition. Getting back out on the water. That's how the East Race Whitewater Kayak Club kicked off summer on Saturday, hosting its first ever festival on the St. Joe River. You guys have amazing talent here. This river needs more notice next year's race. It's going to be a lot bigger than this. While most were excited to just get back on the water, this race was even more special for competitor Elizabeth Bruns. It's one of her first group ones since overcoming her cancer battle. Nice to see everyone come together today and um, just not have the restrictions to be able to get out and paddle again and do stuff we love. Although it's been a difficult journey for Bruns, she says getting back out on the water has been one of her biggest motivators. You have to learn how to overcome challenges and obstacles and make the most of whatever comes your way. And while this is just the first year for the festival, spectators are excited to come back again next year. I'm hoping to maybe shake hands with some Olympians that haven't seen their first Olympics yet. Event organizers tell me this will become an annual event. And for those that are interested in signing up for next year's activities, I'll have more details on our website, abc57.com. Reporting live in South Bend tonight, Samantha Johns, ABC 57 News.